this is Scott Trepp from the Balloon Blast Video Show and from Real Life. Here to help debut an exciting new product from ContinentalSales.net. Now ContinentalSales.net has the private reserve line. That's their line of proprietary balloons, different designs that only they have. So to get the balloons from the private reserve, you have to order from ContinentalSales.net. And the exciting new product they have today is Scott's Baseball Illusion 5-inch round top print. This is a baseball balloon. It's a five inch round white balloon with red stitching on it that gives the illusion of a baseball. Now, this balloon, I've actually been going back and forth with Continental for three years and because of a slight misunderstanding, they haven't been available until now. Um, the sticking point was, originally, they thought we wanted a balloon that had the um, baseball stitching all the way around and ideally that would be good, except for when the balloons are printed, the print area is only so big, and to have a five-sided print would be astronomically priced, not to mention the registration, the lining up, would just be way beyond comprehension to accomplish. So, this balloon, when blown up, has a small print. It's really just the, enough to give the idea of a baseball, but when you blow up a five-inch round balloon to about oh, let's say three inches, and give it a gentle squeeze from the back, check that out, you enlarge the print area. And that is all you really need of a baseball. All right, so once again, when you get your balloon, don't inflate it all the way, because that really uh, puts the print in the front right here. What you want to do is underinflate it, so you have about a three inch balloon. It's really, that's more baseball sized anyway. What you're going to do is squeeze so that all the pressure goes to where the top print is, like this. You see how it grows there? And that gives you all of the impression that you need for that to be a baseball. And really, when you use this in a sculpture, you don't use that where you show all the sides, right? You don't show the knot anyway. And a lot of the balloons are that way. If you look at a 5-inch round Mickey Mouse head, for instance, that's the total surface impression. It doesn't show the back of the head, right? Now, how do you use this balloon? Obviously, you use it as a baseball, right? But I think that uh, just using this balloon as a baseball is really short-sighted. We're balloon artists, we're creative, we can do better than that, right? So I came up with a few different things just to get you started. Um, one thing you can do is a baseball bat. This is two Mocha 321s, one for the uh, knob on the end of the bat, and the rest gives you that taper, so you have a little baseball bat. You have a baseball. Let's grab a... Uh, 260, we have a clear, and tie that around here, like that, tie the other end to the baseball, and just like that we have a little baseball, you can hit like this. Alright, if you don't want to do it that way, let's take that back off, have your baseball bat, same thing, on a hat. This time we used two clear 260s attached to the baseball, you have the baseball bat, and this one's really a lot of fun if you do balloons at a party or a restaurant, you have a lot of these going around, very visual, very kinetic, fills up the sky with balloons and colors. What else? Oh, one of my favorites we have, the baseball glove right here. Um, we have the instructions for this at balloon-animals.com, um, part of the Balloon Blast series of instructions, but there's a wearable baseball glove, the baseball goes right there in the middle, and that illusion top print gives you all you need to see of the baseball right there. Gives a full impression of it. The baseball glove can also be scaled up to 350, so you have that really cool oversized baseball glove. That baseball really tops it off. If you do balloons for college or professional uh, major league baseball games, you have to have the baseball print. <laughs> Absolutely. Now, if you have a little league baseball, or if you do uh, balloons for restaurants and the team comes in, make a baseball trophy. A little baseball right there, just icing on the cake, perfect. And what else? Oh, there are also at least two major league baseball teams and probably dozens of minor league baseball teams that have a baseball face mascot. I know that sounds weird, but look up baseball mascot, you'll find them. Um, this guy made sort of a, just a generic one, but you draw the face on there. You can't really get the same look if you do the stitches with a Sharpie. It never looks just right. Like if you've ever tried drawing the Disney princesses on a round balloon, not the same as an imprint. 
But um, there's our little baseball guy. Lots of other ideas too. So do check out the baseball print. Something really exciting from Continental Sales. And uh, every time you buy a bag, it kind of gives them a vote of confidence that what they're doing is the right thing by giving us more of what we want. They listen to our feedback and produce it. That's a lot better than just letting somebody at a big company produce what they think we want and then for us later to say, oh, I wish they made this in a different color or here's what you did wrong. This way it goes from creator to producer back to creator. Um, support that idea, support the balloons, and make some really cool stuff with the Scott's Baseball White Illusion Private Reserve Balloon from ContinentalSales.net. Play ball! You and I in a little toy shop Buy a bag of balloons with the money we've got Set them free at the break of dawn So one by one, they were gone Back at the base, sparks in the software Flash the message, someone's out there Floating in the summer sky 99 red balloons go by 99